Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, Wendy's Kooky Crochet Tutorial. Today I'm going to teach you how to make this super cute scrunchie that I have right here. All you will need is an elastic band for your the hair type for your hair. Um, I have an eight millimeter hook and then I have um, some really nice puffy yarn. And what I'm doing is I'm just doing a slip knot onto my hook right there with that lovely puffy yarn and what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a slip stitch around this um, elastic band so around this um, ponytail holder right here so I'm just going to slip right there and then from there I'm going to just half double crochet all the way around this and I'm doing this kind of like you would do when you um, work into a magic ring something like that so you're just going all the way around and I'm half double crocheting all the way around. And um, what you're wanting here, there's no, I can't tell you exactly how many stitches to make. That's kind of up to you how many stitches you make around this. I love these and the reason I love these and I go all the way around. Some people don't even go all the way around. Some people like to just make cute little um, designs in it and but I like to go all the way around so now I'm just speeding it up a little bit so you're not bored watching me just do half double crochets all the way around here and when you get kind of to the end what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to kind of scrunch it up a little bit kind of make it wavy and then do more half double crochets all the way around or do ha more half double crochets anyway and again that's until you get to the end so you see right here how I'm doing it and if you really wanted to you could only make one round I'm making two for this because I like mine to really stand out but you could make more than one and you see how, there how I just moved the yarn down some so I could make it more scrunchy and there I was just pulling it so I could see if it's if I'm seeing a whole lot of the pink elastic band through the yarn and I was seeing a lot of it through the yarn and that's not really what I want so here again I'm going to make a couple of more half double crochets there just so it's really tight and then I'm going to make a slip stitch in the top of the first half double crochet I made and again some people only like one round and if you like one round you can stop right there but I'm going to make one more round so after I make that slip stitch what I'm going to do is I'm going to chain one but then I realized gosh I did not crochet over that end look I could have crocheted right over that end and not had to work it in but I didn't so what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to bring that end up and I'm going to crochet right over it so if you forget to do that like I just did it's no big deal so there I just chained one and now I'm going to make two half double crochets in each of the half double crochet rows I just made so there's two in that row so each one will have two half double crochets in in the single half double crochet on the row that you just made and you're going to do that all the way around till you get to that first stitch there for the first half double crochet that you made and when you're done with that all you're going to do is you're going to slip stitch into that very first half double crochet you made and you're going to tie it off and then you're going to weave in those ends there now these ends can get a little bit frayed and what some people will do is some people will kind of take a lighter or a match to them and burn the ends I don't like to do that because I'm actually afraid I'm going to set something on fire so I do not do that so it's normal for the ends to get a bit frayed and you'll see there's little pieces that come off and that's okay you're going to weave these in really good and they're not going to come out so that's definitely definitely okay and I will say if you like selling things at um, festivals or craft shows that type of thing these scrunchies especially this pattern is a really really great seller one thing that I always say especially with this pattern since it's my favorite one to actually wear is that 
if I wear just elastic in my hair, then that is going to give me just a horrible headache by the end of the day. But when I do this nice velvety puffy yarn around my elastic band, then I do not get a headache. I can wear this all day long and it does not give me a headache. Time after time I've done this and it does not give me a headache. So that I think is just truly wonderful. And again, I'm doing these half double crochets all the way around two half double crochets in the one half double crochet that we did before and right here I'm almost finished I'm going to do just a couple more half double crochets here and then I'm going to slip stitch into that first half double crochet made and it can be kind of hard to see that and um, if you make it tight like I do then it's a little hard to work in and then all I'm going to do now is I'm going to get my little scissors here and I'm going to cut that and then I'm going to take a smaller crochet hook and I'm just going to weave in these in so you can weave them in back and forth and you see how like the little stuff's just kind of flying off that's okay if that happens it does happen again some people like to burn the ends but I don't so I did a little bit back and forth there and then I worked it in towards the bottom so at the bottom right there I'm just going to weave that in right where the elastic part is so I'm just weaving that part in where the elastic is and um, I'm going to do that one more time I'm getting a little bit of the frayed stuff off so there I weaved it all in and there you go that is all there is to making this this is a fun quick and easy thing to make and if you like this video please consider subscribing to my channel and uh, ring the bell so you get notifications thanks for watching have fun crocheting